Thank you. Welcome back to another video and in today's video we are here for game four of this four game set against the Houston Astros And today I'm sitting with my buddy Jenny. How's it going? Going good. And I see you got what I got today. I got helmet nachos I got them too. They, they reverted back to the small ones. I don't like that Yeah, I was looking forward to the big helmet Same here But today the A's are playing the Astros once again last night they beat the Astros 4-1. to Tyler Geloff got his first career home run, and today they're giving out a retro bobblehead, which I think is honestly one of the best bobbleheads they've given out this season. I'm gonna have someone, maybe even Jenny, open up the bobblehead to show it off, but I'm really hungry right now. We're gonna go ahead and uh, devour these nachos real quick. All right, so I got 510 bobbles right here. He's gonna open up the retro bobblehead that we got today. Jenny's still eating, so <laughs> sorry. Nice We're just box. gonna, you know, he's gonna do the review here. It's a nice box. All right, let's see what we got here. All right. Uh, at first glance, it's, it's a lot heavier than last week's, I'll tell you that. A lot heavier. Heaviest bobblehead ever? Yeah. Question mark? It's heavy. It's <laughs> it might be for A's SGAs. Very glossy, just like traditional knotters. I like that they put Comerica Bank on the back. That's a nice feature. That's really cool. Uh, BDNA made it. It's nice. Let's, have, let's see how the bobble is. It's a good nod. That's a good bobble right there. It's a good nod. They put black cleats on it. Don't like that. Come on. I'm pretty sure we, we know someone that can fix that. Yeah, but it's, come on. Yeah. All in all? Out of 10, what would you give it? Ooh. I give it a six. Six? I like player bobbles. True. Right? Like if we're gonna do an SGA bobblehead, we had such a long history of great players that we could have done. Um, and this is, you know, aside from Mandalorian Katze this year, which wasn't even an SGA, this is as close as we got to a player bobble. Kind of weak, but eh. What about as for this year? Is it the best bobblehead this year? For sure. For sure? Uh, I'd give Groot, actually. I like the base on Groot. And I didn't even know who Groot was. So. <laughs> but uh, there you have it. This is up there. This is up there. It's good. All right, and then I didn't get to show off the box of this bobblehead, but we got some questions on the side. We got this, and then we have 72, 73, and 74, and I believe 73 were on the 50th anniversary of the 73 uh, World Series team, so that's why we have that bolded. Let's go back to the questions here. Let's see who can answer these questions in the comments. How many World Series did the A's win in the 70s? There you go. You can drop your answer. Who did the A's play in the 1973 World Series? Which two players hit a home run in the fi final game of the 1973 World Series? And then finally, who was the 1973 World Series MVP? The AJ Blade to the right field bleachers. Let's go. Oh, okay, A's take the lead. Stay hot, JJ. Let's go. Okay. Let's go! High five! High five! <laughs> Alright, so check it out. We're back in the lounge seats. Not gonna sit here for long, but. Oh. Alright, guys, so we're sitting in the lounge seats. Not for long, but we're gonna sit here for a little bit. And we can't have a bobblehead day without the king of bobbles himself. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it is clean, too. I love it. So, what are your thoughts on this bobblehead? Mark gave me his insight. He gave it a 6 out of 10 for his first note. Yeah. So what do you think about it personally? Well, I guess maybe it's a bias because we don't get much of anything here lately. So I'm gonna go closer to like a like a seven or eight, seven and a half, let's say, because we haven't got anything this quality in a long time. I agree, I like a player one, but but this is good for a generic little ball player, dude. I like it. I think it's good. Would you say this is like the be the best bobbleheads that we've gotten this season? Yeah, I'm 
kind of fond of the Groot because I like the base on the Groot. I thought it was really cool, a little bit thoughtful. This is not so much thoughtful, but it's a decent bobblehead. So I like I'd probably it. put the Groot above it, though. I like it. I like the I like the fact that it actually bobbles compared to like you know <laughs> uh, the recent bobbleheads. It just you know they're small. Yeah. So, but I I give it a good rating. Way better than the Captain Marvel. It's Way better. Captain Marvel. The other one with the lightest. This is probably the heaviest. Yeah, exactly. Right? Exactly. Castro's take the lead. Oh wow, that was next to my seats. <laughs> Alright, so as you saw, the Houston Astros just hit a home run, so this game is now tied at one apiece. But I was in the team store because I was buying a shirt. It's uh, It was the item sale of the game, and it pretty much just says Oakland on the front, Kelly Green and everything. So had to get that. He dropped the ball! Let's go! Jordan Diaz, is that you? Yes, it is, fellow 13. Alright guys, so I'm back at the seat with Jenny. She's recording me right now, so give uh, drop a thumbs up for Jenny for holding on my camera. But, so this is the shirt right here. I got it. It says Oakland on the front. It's a Kelly Green. Nice material, and I just think it looks cool. So I thought this was cool, but yeah, I was not gonna buy this for $49. I bought it for $20, and I got two free vouchers. So you're gonna see me come back here, even though I was already gonna come back here. Oh! Let's go! Try to throw him out, ball way out into the field. Runner goes to third. Let's go! Tyler Soderstrom, RBI single. Straight up the middle. Bases loaded now for the Astros as Mauricio Dubon tries to tie this game up or potentially take the lead. Let's go, dude, Becky. Here we go. Two down. Scott here with bases loaded. Dang. Well, this game is tied. Walked in a run. There we go. Able to keep it a tie game. Going to the bottom of the seventh. Here we go. Come on, Seth. Runners on first and second now. And he's going to drop a butt here. Runners moved over. One out in the center. Mark, are we gonna score? Cody Yo, Thomas? Yeah? yeah? That's a lock, dude. Let's go. Cody Thomas? Oh! Dang, two bunts. That's why you never bunt in. Never, ever bunts. Kotze never bunts. Sell the team. Sell the team. He's got one hit today and his first RBI. Can he make more? Dang. Well, we did not score. That ball hit well to left field. Mauricio Dubon bidding for a home run and he has one. Mauricio Dubon on a 1 2 pitch gives the Astros their first lead of the game. It is three to two. Uh, I just caught a home run ball. Dude, you got a hey. camera on you, man. <laughs> I didn't even have my glove on. <laughs> I know, I saw you. That was awesome. Jesus that was Christ. Awesome, man. That sucks. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, Mauricio Dubon's home run, go ahead home run, but uh, yeah. It sucks. It was an opposing team's home run, but this is my second home run of the season. Uh, my first one, obviously, was Ramon's home run, so yeah. It's cool. I got another one, but any more A's home runs, please. All right, guys, we're going down to the bottom of the ninth inning with two outs now. George, or, sorry, wrong Diaz. A lead Miss Diaz is up. Let's see if we can continue this game. Yep, and the Astros beat the A's three to two. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Astros take this series three to one. And while it is very unfortunate that I caught the game-winning uh, home run, it sucks. <laughs> it sucks. All right, guys. So this is where I'm gonna end my video. Uh, as you guys saw, the Houston Astros defeat the Oakland Athletics and took the series three to one. And also, I got a home run ball from the Astros, Mauricio Dubon, former Giant, 
It was his 23rd career home run, his fifth home run of the 2023 season. Uh, and yeah, I mean, I saved my friend's life, I saved Jenny's life, and I saved Mark's life by reaching out for it. And I, I kind of wish I didn't, but uh, it is what it is. And I know Martin, my friend Martin, is, hates me, but I mean, I'm sorry, Martin. I just couldn't, I can't throw him back. If I catch it, I, I'm not throwing him back. For the next video, I will see you guys in San Francisco. We're gonna unite the bay and rock these cell shirts. We're gonna have the green ones and the black ones. And from there, on, after that, we're gonna head down to LA for Dodger Stadium. So that should be fun. So expect some road trips now out of this. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new. Don't forget guys, life begins at the end of your comfort. See you guys on Tuesday. Unite the Bay. Peace. Had to get away from all that toxic energy.